it's Brittany and Alicia. Alondra, that's right. So when I did my Ikea haul, so many of you guys loved having my daughter in it and she honestly was hilarious and made the video. So I asked her if she would so graciously film this video with me and she said yes. So here we are. So today we are going to do a kitchen haul. I needed a ton of kitchen stuff. So we did a lot of shopping at Costco, Home Goods, Ross, TJ Maxx, and I think that's all of it. So a lot of the bigger stuff is from, she's already getting started. A lot of the bigger stuff is from Costco. And I would say like the litter, the littler, the more little, the littler, the smaller items are from like Home Goods, Ross, TJ Maxx. Although I think most of the stuff, oh, thank you. Oh yes. I would say most of the stuff is probably more home goods. But anyways, let's get started since she is clearly started. The first thing she pulled out is, oh, I need this here. Some of the stuff is already out of the box because we needed to use it. I told my husband we couldn't use anything until I filmed this haul. And he was like, no girl, look at her. She is like a YouTuber already. So this is the sponge that we got. So yeah, I mean, nothing too crazy, but I'm actually really excited about these sponges. I'm already using one because, well, this was an item that like we couldn't wait to use. We had to use it. So this is the Practical Matter Natural Fiber All Purpose Non Scratch Sponge. It's a two pack. It says it can normally retails for four nine for four dollars, and I got it for two ninety nine. And so yeah, you know, just a, I don't know. I just really wanted a natural fiber sponges, so that's what we got. And I love them. I mean, I can't complain. Been using it for like a week and a half now, so doing good so far. But anyways, yeah, that's the first thing that we got. The next thing we got, this is actually from Ross. This one is from Home Goods. So I have a couple of things just like mixed in the bags. But yeah, so this is from Ross. And it says compare at $8 and we only pay $3.99. It is from the brand Casabella. It's a sink cider, so it's a suction cup holder. So you can see here in the picture, it um, holds your sponge and then like a taller, longer type sponge, which I actually really need to get one. Um, I just thought it would look good to like plug, to plug, to put into our sink. We have like a really nice, big, deep sink. So I figured this would look good like on the inside instead of just chilling on the top. You know what I'm saying? So anyways, that is that. What's the next one, baby? Oh, so the next thing that I got, which I'm actually really excited about, good job, baby. It is a mason jar soap closer. dispenser. Oh, you're gonna get closer? Okay, get closer. Oh, wow. So as you guys saw in the close-up shot, this is a mason jar soap dispenser. I mean, we're gonna put this in the, thank you. We're gonna put this in the sink. It says compared $8, it's normally $4.99. Looking on like a mason jar soap dispenser, funny enough, on Amazon, and they were really expensive like 12 plus dollars. So when I saw this for $4.99, I was really excited. I just hope this doesn't rust because I heard that these do rust easily. So fingers crossed it doesn't. But that is everything, I guess, just those three items in that bag. We do have another bag. Oh, I hate the sound of like that. Like, anybody else hate that sound? But anyway, here, fold it up like Christmas grabbing what's in there all right I have no idea what this crap is for my husband picked out most of the kitchen stuff I have no idea you guys but this is um from cook supply co it's a three-piece mess mesh I can't talk mesh strainer set um we got this at Ross it is normally ten dollars we paid $6.99 but yeah so it's stainless steel mesh basket for rinsing and straining so um so yeah Good times. Oh yeah, the next thing we got, we got this at Home Goods. This is like a, um, what is it, like a mallet, you know, to beat the chicken, you know, so. Not to carne. Oh, for carne? Oh, I'm sorry, okay, yeah, let's not hit me with that. But yeah, you know, it's just to beat the meat. Yeah. No. All right, we paid $3.99. We can just put this away, it was at Home Goods. All right, so the next thing we have is cotton twine. I honestly have no idea what it's for. Oh, get that close-up shot, girl. Yes, so fancy. <laughs> um, but yeah, we just paid $1.99 for it at Home Goods. I don't know what he used. I think he uses it to like tie up stuff. Anyways, I don't know. Like I said, most of this stuff, my husband, that was at Home Goods. And then the next two items um, go hand in hand. Um, that's just how it is. I think it's so cute though. Um, we thought we needed new measuring cups and we still have some. <laughs> we actually still have ours, but 
We really like the look of these more. We were like, maybe we should return them, but we really like these. So I don't think we're going to return them. We're going to keep them. But they are from Progressive Prep Works. It's just measuring cups, you know. These were normally $10 and we paid $5.99. It's just the big ones. And then these are the little ones, which I love the look of the little ones. Here get a better shot of it so there's kind of like an up close shot of what it looks like i don't know like i like the handles i just think it's just super cute and just aesthetically pleasing so yeah these were normally six dollars we paid 3.99 and it is the um the same brand as these i'm really weird it has to be the same brand it has to match my husband could care less but um no girl i need the same exact thing now these items here we already opened we got them at no, home goods good. ross home goods we got this at ross um it's a six pack of spoons it's from the brand sharper image i don't know if we paid 3.99 or 4.99 but we really needed some wooden spoons and my husband liked that they were like red tipped on the bottom so that's why we picked them we don't really know like about the brand but i mean we've been using them and they're good so far oh good job now the next thing that I, we got i know for sure we got at home goods it is a colander obviously you know for to drain things. I don't know what the price was on it, but they had a ton of these. And you love to put things on your head. But um, yeah, so we just really needed a colander, so that's why we got it. And that is everything from Ross and Home Goods. Everything is from Ross and Home Goods. I get confused because like we went to two different Home Goods. Home Goods had like it was like a Marshall Home Goods, so I was confused, and then it was a TJ Maxx Home Goods. But thank you. But anyways, it was basically all Home Goods and Ross. So the next bulk of everything is going to be from Costco. So you want this. I see it. Oh, there goes that. This is from, I opened it and I was like, wait, we can't use it. Haul. This is from Costco. I don't even know how much it is, but it's from KitchenAid or how much we paid for it. I can't recall, but it's from KitchenAid and we wanted like black gray items for like our kitchen. So it is just a four pack. It is the mitts and then what are these called? The pot holders. So you can put your hand inside but yeah it's from KitchenAid and we really liked it um so as soon as we saw it at Costco we grabbed I these I know we probably got these I would say early September or end of August so we've had these for a while we actually bought these before we left old drunk you before we left um California so hopefully Costco still have these but I can't recall seeing them recently but anyways um the next thing we got here are these knives which I'm so excited about you want to hold it okay um, so these are from Cuisine Art. It is how many? One, two, three, four, five, six knives. Oh yeah, it says right here. Hello. They actually had a colorful version of this and we went to buy the colorful knives and then they were sold out. This was when we were in California. We're like, dang it. And so we're like, whatever, we'll just buy whatever knives, you know, in the future, it's not a big deal. We don't need them right now. And then, oh, gotta get that close up. Thanks, honey. <laughs> and then um, we were in Costco. It was the same time we bought those KitchenAid gloves and we saw the black ones and I was like, oh my God, I love the black ones so much more. So I got them and these were $12.99. They don't keep this kind of stuff all the time. And we were in a Costco and I actually saw these in our Texas Costco. So they still have them. So if you're into them, check them out. I also like that they have a cover for it. So um, I like that. The next thing that we got um, are, here we go, is silverware. We got two packs of silverware. Yeah, the next items we had to unbox, so I will insert clips of the items, like a close-up shot anyways. But this is just silverware. We ended up getting two boxes. It is from the brand Hinkles. It was from Costco as well. Um, there's nothing in there, baby. It's just garbage in there. Um, it's a trick. But how, what does it have? So it has four dinner knives, four dinner forks, four spoons, salad forks, and four teaspoons. So yeah, it's a 20 piece set and we got two of them. So to go along with all silverware, we obviously need plates, right? So we got this at Costco as well. It is from the brand Denmark. I do not think they sell these anymore. We ended up getting two boxes and my mother-in-law actually bought these for us. So thank you, Mama Mari. Um, But yeah, it's just plain, simple white dishes. And we really like the look of like simple, plain white dishes. So we ended up getting two boxes of these guys. The next thing is just, it's just big. The box is just big. But anyways, there you go. It is from the brand Hinkles or Hinkles. I don't know how to say it, but it's the same brand as our silverware. It is Capri Granitium. Granitium? I don't know. Um, but yeah, it's a three pack of frying pans, basically. We really, really, really like them. Um, they were a little bit on, no, not a little bit. They were on the pricey side. These were $79.99. Um, but like I said, with, um, Costco, sometimes like you see something 
and then it, it sells out and you can't find it again. So we were worried that this would happen to these. The good thing about Costco is, is it ever goes down on sale, we can always get our money back. So that is okay. But yeah, we honestly love them. They're scratch resistant. Um, they're safe to use with metal utensils and stuff like that. So yeah, I don't know. So far so good. We really, really, really do like them. And they still are at Costco, our Costco anyways. And we bought these in Texas. Okay, this last one here. Ooh. I know how. You can do it? Yeah. Oh my God, look how strong she is. Wow, she's holding up this, all these pots and pans. They're in there, you guys. Do you believe me? They're really not in there, but dang, Alondra. <laughs> okay, so these are from Calphalon. If you watch our daily vlogs, let me help you, honey. If you watch our daily vlogs, then you would have known um, that we did buy these, and we got a really good deal on them. <laughs> we got a really good deal on them. Um, it is a 10-piece dishware set. It's from the brand Calphalon. I don't know if I said that. I, they do not sell this exact one anymore. When we were at our Costco, it was actually being clearanced out and they only had two of these left. I think it was like $224 was the sale price and it was normally like $279, I think. Um, but I know when we looked it up on Amazon, it was... Was it over 300? I don't know. It was definitely a lot more than the Costco price. So yeah, it's just a tin piece set. It has its stainless seal and it says it has five layers with a copper core. Edam is obsessed with them. He really loves them. And if you guys don't know, my husband is obsessed with cooking. He actually has a cooking channel. He hasn't uploaded in over a year. So, so yeah, my husband actually has a cooking channel. He only has maybe like five or six videos up. I will link it down below. He's probably going to kill me. But um, yeah, they are pretty old. It's when we actually lived in Minnesota. But I mean, he is an amazing, amazing cook. If you guys watch our vlogs, everything you see him cook, everyone's like salivating because it's so good and everybody loves his cooking. So anyways, check out his channel if you want to learn. Just like I said, there's only like five or six videos. He's wanting to do more videos. So hopefully now that we're in Texas, he'll start back up again. So we will see. But um. Anyways, I'm rambling now, got totally off topic, but that's Let's just go. that's just me. Yeah, we're done, baby. We are done, and we can finally unbox all of these items and put them away and give them a new home. Mama so anyways, go. I'm gonna go ahead and go. I'm gonna stop rambling. I hope you guys did Yay. enjoy this kitchen haul. Um, I don't know if I'll be able to link any of this stuff down below because like I said, it was like Ross and Home Goods and Costco. I will try. I will try to see what I can find maybe on Amazon and link it down below. So check out the description, um, but I will try to do my best for you guys. But like I said, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Please give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.